Preeti, we are here with the another question of exercise 9.1, page number 182, question number 9, which is greater in each of the following. So, we are having 5 parts in the question. We will start with the first one. In the first one, we have 2 by 3 and 5 by 2. So, for comparing, the denominator should be same. So, first of all, we are going to multiply the rational numbers with each other's denominator. So 2 2s are 4, 3 2s are 6, 5 3s are 15 and 3 2s are 6. Now at the place of 2 by 3 we are going to write 4 by 6 and at the place of 5 by 2 15 by 6. So 15 by 6 is greater and 15 by 6 is representing 5 by 2. So the 5 by 2 is the greater one. Now comes to the part 2. In the part 2 we have minus 5 by 6 and minus 4 by 3. So we are going to equal the denominators. So in this one we have 6. We can make this 3, 6. So for that we will multiply it by the 2 in the numerator and the denominator both. So this will become 4, 2 is 8 and 3, 2 is 6. So we are having minus 5 by 6 and minus 8 by 6. Now, in the negative, when we have negative rational numbers, then or the negative fraction, whatever from both of these, the greater number will be the smaller and the smaller will be the greater when we are having negative signs. So, 8 will be the smaller and 5 will be the greater because it is having negative sign. So, this is the part 2. Now, this one is representing the original digit for minus 8 by 6 is minus 4 by 6. 3. So, minus 4 by 3 is the smaller and the minus 5 by 6 is the greater 1. Now, comes to the part 3. Now, in the part 3, we have minus 3 by 4 and 2 by minus 3. Now, first of all, we are going to equal the denominators. For that, we are going to multiply it by the each other's denominator. So, 3 2s are 3 3 is a 9 and 4 3 is a 12. Now, 4 2s are 8 and 4 3 is a 12. So, we are having digit minus 9 by 12. I am going to shift this to the numerator. So, it is 8 by 12. Now, we have 9 by 12 and the 8 by 12. As we know that smaller will be the uh, greater number. If we are having negative side, then minus 8 by 12 is the greater number. So, this is representing the original number minus 3 by 4 and 2 by minus 3. So, in this one, 2 by minus 3 is the greater 1. So, this is the part 3. Now comes to the part 4. In the part 4 we have minus 1 by 4 and 1 by 4. Now we know that the denominators are same. Now this is the minus 1 by 4 and this is the 1 by 4. So the positive number will be the bigger one. So 1 by 4 is the greater. So now comes to the part, part 5. Minus 3 is to 2 by 7 and minus 3, 4 by 5. Now, this is in the mixed fraction. First of all, we are going to make them in the fraction. So, 7 3s are 21, 21 and 2, 23, minus 23 by 7 and 5 3s are 15, 15 and 4, 19, minus 19 by 5. Now, this is the fraction we have. First of all, we will make them comparable by making their denominators equal. So, for that one, we will multiply it by the each other's denominator. Now 5 3 is a 15, carry 1, 5 2 is a 10 and 1, 11 and 7 5 is a 35. Now 19 7 is a 133. So this is minus 133, 5 3 is a 5 7 is a 35. Now we are having 115 by 35 and minus 133 by 30. Fine. Now we'll have to compare it. Now as we know that when we are having negative sign then the greater will be the smaller and the smaller will be the greater one. So minus 115 by 35 is greater than minus 133 by 35. Now this is representing minus 3 is to 2 by 7 and this one is minus 3 is to 4 by 5. So minus 3 is to 2 by 7 is the greater 1. So with this one we have completed the question number 9. In the next video we are going to start with the question number 10.